Hi, this is Kevin from WordBot. In this video, I'm going to be going over WordBot's new feature built into our SEO analysis tool that allows you to analyze your competitor's headings and be able to download those for further research, whether it's um, individual competitors or all of the competitors that um, we analyze for your articles in the top 10 results. So if you haven't signed up for WordBot, um, you can sign up and you'll get some free uh, runs, I believe we're doing, let me log out and show you here. So if you go to wordbot.io, you get five free competitor searches per month. So um, what we'll be doing in this video will allow you to follow along here as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and log back in. And then I'm gonna go back to our analyze tab, which we'll be focusing on. So if you haven't used wordbot before, you'll wanna add a project. And that's just a kind of grouping of the projects where you'll be uh, writing articles for, analyzing them and things like that. And then your project, once you get in here, you wanna enter in the keyword that you wanna, um, your focus keyword for your article. Now you don't have to put in an, an, a URL um, initially, you can hit add web page and then it'll look like this. And then you can run an analysis against your competitors. And then what that'll do is it'll give you the top 10 results back from Google with uh, some analysis that I'm gonna show you here now. So uh, this uh, word here, chat GPT rewrite text, um, I wrote this on February 3rd. Um, it's currently March 5th. And when I first ran this, let me, um, well, if you haven't ran the tool yet, you wanna go ahead and press the competitor analysis first. So when we first came in here, you know, we uh, didn't have the option for you to be able to download headings, but now you can. So if you click on these for any particular user um, or, I mean, competitor, you'll get all of the, their heading types, the types and then the text, and then if it contains the keywords. And then up at the top there, you have the URL and the position that they are in. So here we have the option to download just this competitor's keywords, I mean, our headings, and then also up here at the top, we have the ability to download all the headings for each of the 10 results. So the great thing about this tool and this new feature we added, so, um, you know, sometimes this is a great thing to see, okay, they have this many H1s, this many H2s and threes, but now you can dig a lot further and not only see, but, um, you know, not only understand how many they have, but what they're kind of focusing on. So here you might see, okay, their H2 is the great writers, the great books. So you might even be able to find some great um, new keywords to focus on that they might not be targeting um, as, as much. And then just to show you here under the rank and score, as you start to, um, you know, get better head, headings and um, write better articles, as you can see, when I first started this article, we were only in the 50, uh, we were plus 50 position out of the 100 that we scanned for in Google. So that means I wasn't even in the top, you know, a couple pages. And then almost two or three weeks later, I was in the two um, position. And now I'm position one for this uh, keyword. And we can actually check for that. So if I go back to page stats here, now I don't want to get too far off here, but if we open this in, oops, open that in Google search, sometimes, so here we are, number one. And... Now, so what I want to do is, so if I want to download all the headings, so going back to what we, uh, the original, which we were originally talking about, this is going to pull up a CSV, which opened up in my other screen here. So now we have all the headings that are related to the top 10 results. So this is going to give us position one through 10. So we get all the headings, the H1s, the twos, the threes, fours, all the way up to H6. Then if you only want to focus on a particular competitor, which is okay to do sometimes, um, let's say, you know what, we just want to focus on the H2s that, you know, position two is getting. We want to at least get to position two. See what they're talking about, what the flow is. So we can go ahead and press this um, download button there, open that up. And now it's just in the, still in the same format, but it's just, only going to have that competitors. 
So now you can do some things like, you know, maybe seeing, hey, you know, this one, they're talking about prompt engineering. Um, you know, they have something that's talking about, uh, let's see, nested HTML is not crawled. Um, Bing AI. So maybe, you know what, hey, what, maybe I can use Bing AI as a keyword or something. So now instead of just seeing how many um, headings they have, you can now start to dig a lot deeper into what your competitors are actually doing. So again, if you haven't signed up, you know, like I said, you get free, uh, five free analysis per month. You don't have, and the analysis only count when you run this. So you can still utilize this month over month until you start to get, need more and more articles that you're uh, writing for. And then the, um, you can always refresh your article for free. So those don't count towards your five per month. That way, if there are any changes in regards to your article, um, you can rerun this against the results uh, that are currently already staged in here. So again, if you have any questions, leave a comment down below in the video. In regards to WordBot, uh, be sure to get back with you. Again, thanks for tuning in. Hope to see you next time.